This is your fast cast for Friday, May 31st. The top story we're following at this moment on Friday. One of the stranded Malaysian climbers has been rescued from Denali Friday morning. He told officials the other man died several days ago. They were part of a trio of climbers who sent a distress call early Tuesday. The message said they were hypothermic and unable to get back down on their own. One of the party made it to the base camp and was medevaced out of Talkeetna that night in critical condition. Weather hampered efforts to make it to the other two. Thursday nights, survival gear was dropped at their location and crews managed to airlift the survivor out on Friday. Plans are being made to recover the other climber's body. A 50-year-old man is accused of firing a gun at someone, attacking them, and ramming their car with an ATV. Alaska State Troopers arrested a suspect after he ran away from a house on West Sourdough Drive in Wasilla. When found, he allegedly sprayed bear spray at a trooper canine named Blitz and officers. The suspect allegedly had a gun, knife, and drug paraphernalia with him, and had a federal warrant. He was held at Matsu pretrial after the hospital medically cleared him. Troopers didn't say why he needed to be medically cleared. We have more online at alaskasnewsource.com. Six people are safe, including two children, after their boat capsized three miles off the shore from the Kenai Peninsula. Alaska State Troopers were told this weekend that the 18-foot aluminum fishing boat had turned over about two miles south of Nanilchik. The six people were picked up by charter fishing vessel, the Grinch. The Good Samaritan crew brought them back to the boat launch. Emergency personnel were there to evaluate them, but the victims declined further medical treatment. This has been your Fastcast for Friday, May 31st. Thank you so much for watching.